What's up guys, Ryan here. So I'm going to show you in this video how to create Kindle Direct publishing covers using a browser based tool from our friends at BookBolt. And if you're not familiar with the BookBolt brand, this is the same team that brought us Merch Informer, which is a, a very nice suite of tools to help us excel at Amazon Merch. Now I've called uh, Kindle Direct publishing Amazon Merch for books and it makes sense that people who made software for Amazon Merch which is probably very similar code base would then, you know, replicate their source and come up with a, uh, a very similar tool for KDP. Anyways, I digress. I'm going to show you how to design your KDP covers using their web browser based tool. So once you're signed up for BookBolt, and you can go ahead and use the link in the description, there should be a three day free trial available. Go up to the top right corner where it says your name, click your name and then go to BookBolt uh, designer. All right, I already have it open because it sometimes takes a second to load and then choose your template. So I had recommended in the past. Um, first, you can design covers and interiors. We're going to do cover trim size six by nine inch page count 120. Then we're going to hit submit. And uh, it's going to take a minute or so to not a minute, probably less, but to generate the template, it's going to be variable like using these sort of browser based tools. It uses some of your computer resources. Keep that in mind. If you're on a slow computer, it's going to take longer. If you're on a faster computer, it will go faster. Now, mine's going to go a little slow because I'm rendering two videos, <laughs> two other YouTube videos as I do this. But there we go. We're good. So this is the uh, most recent book that I designed. Uh, and I'm going to, you know what, go ahead and delete it. And we'll just start right here. I'm going to walk you through the whole design process. The first thing I wanted to point out, though, is look at the rules on this uh, on this canvas so what that represents is the portion that we cannot design on okay and I'm actually gonna publish another video where I walk you through how to design your own covers using software like Photoshop for instance I can actually give you a preview because I got it open right here all right and you can see I use a very similar rule in my Photoshop design as the one they provide here the only thing they didn't really uh, mark is where the barcode's going to go because the barcode will go on the uh, left half in the bottom right corner. So anyways, I'm going to walk you through how to use this tool. So first things first, product color. We can change the background color around as we see fit. Your first time logging in, you should see white. I think black looks better. So why don't we go ahead and use that? Uh, if you don't want to use like a full black, you could maybe go with like, this is a benefit of being a web developer. I started to memorize hex codes for colors. I like uh, 333333, which is like a little bit of a grayish black. All right, maybe not that gray. Maybe we go like uh, 121212. All right, that looks good to me. And next, we have to add our text. So over here on the left-hand side, the product tab is selected by default. We'll go down to the text tool. All right, so click that. And then I'm going to use this font called Righteous. I just like the way it looks. And you can just click it to um, reposition it. Try to center it and then use that bottom right corner arrow to enlarge it. You can click in to change the text. So I was, I just went to Amazon and looked up like, I think I looked up uh, Gag Gift Journal. And one of the funny ones I saw that was selling was, uh, I think it said, it will probably and then essentially said something like this the default font uh text color is this like aqua blue i don't know why let's make it white again i've got that hex code memorized but they have a color picker right here there's no need to memorize hexadecimal color codes it's one of the things that happens if you're a web developer using them all day every day all right, and then next I'm gonna switch fonts for the uh, kind of the punchline of the joke that makes it a gag. And I'm gonna use this Alex brush because it looks very elegant, which makes it kind of funnier. And then I'm gonna say, get worse. And let's make this, for one, let's make it white. and make it no bigger than the uh, probably. You know what, maybe we, let's see, should we make this all caps? I think it looks good, maybe a little bit smaller. There we go. 
So this is a simple approach to designing your own book covers. Keep in mind, unlike Amazon Merch where we design PNGs, these need to be PDFs. So using a tool like this, may you may find easier. It all depends on what you're used to. But if you're happy with how this looks, I mean, this is honestly, this is good enough to sell. And the um, when I looked at Amazon and got this idea, I mean, this is basically a replication. So maybe, you know, change it a little bit to make it your own. But this this had sold, you know, and I'm going to do some other I'll put some other content out about how to tell when products have sold to do like niche validation for your books, etc. So when you are done, just go ahead and click the download button in the top left. And it'll say preparing for a second. Boom, you can click download. If you're in Chrome, it might open in a new tab, but you can download from here. And this is it. I mean, this is the magic. This is what it looks like. It's nothing crazy. You will notice that the uh, design rule here, that like red overlay with the dashed line, that did not get brought over into our download. Um, that definitely would not look good at all. Probably get rejected if you uploaded it. But what this does, it shows you know the left half of the cover, the right half of the cover, and then down the middle is the spine. And you can put text on the spine as well, just so you know. So that's it, guys. So you download it from here and then upload it with your submission to KDP. And, um, you know, we can also design our own book covers. And the next video is going to show you how to do that. Passive Income School is open. Enroll now at ryansmethod.com. Thank you.